Hello world, today I'm going to show you how to write a PHP program that gets the user's IP address and other information, saves it to a spreadsheet file, and displays it back to the user. Alright, let's begin. Alright, here we're just going to see what it's going to look like whenever the user sees the output. You're going to get their IP address, host name, the browser and operating system, GPS coordinates, and also their ISP provider, city and states, and country. Now these will usually show up if you put them and put this PHP file on a remote web server. In this case, I am using my local host here, and so they just didn't appear. And of course, finish it off with a timestamp. Okay, the source code. We're going to begin. Start out here by giving a name to the output file that we're going to write to. In this case, we're going to use a comma separated value. It doesn't take up much memory and any spreadsheet program can read it. Okay, and then we're going to use the environment variable here of the user's IP address. We're going to pass it in to this website here. It's going to return a little JSON object. We're going to decode it in PHP and we're going to save it in this details variable here. And the ampersands that we're going to have here they're just to hide the errors because we don't want them popping up for the user if uh, some user uh, happens to come across an error. Okay, then we're going to use that same environment variable, the uh, IP address, and we're going to get the host name for it, store it there. And then we're going to write everything to file here. We're just going to open up a file handler here, fopen, output web bug, this A here. We're going to append everything to the end of the file that we're opening up. We don't want to override the existing data. Okay, so if our file handle opened up properly, then we're going to build this string out of the various uh, uh, things that we came across. We're going to get an environment variable, the query string, which is everything after the question mark in your URL. And to get the IP address, host name, get the browser and operating system here, where they got the link for this page. Latitude and longitude, internet service provider, the city, the state, and the country that the user's at right now, and also a timestamp. Okay, we write everything to file, write our string to the file handle using uh, PHP's fputs function here, and then we're just going to close the file. Alright, and this case, we're just rebuilding the string all the same data but now we're adding a bunch of HTML tags and along with some relevant information to uh, display to the user and now that we've rebuilt the string we can send it to the user echo this out into a web page format with a title and a head and a body and everything else echo the string and I, we have our closing tags and that's all there is to it it's that easy and you're your CSV file is going to look something like this. Your query string, IP addresses, and just so you know, everything in here is made up. I'm not going to display my user's IP information. Uh, but you can find out some very useful information. Like you can see here, like you, you might find there are several web robots that are crawling your website. It's a pretty good little program to have here where they got the file, GPS coordinates, etc., etc., city, state, country, and of course the timestamp. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching.